Happy April 24th, everyone. I'm Liam, and we are playing the 2024 quest calendar, The Leaf Riders of Renwood. Yesterday, Ivy and Party managed to sneak into this giant beehive right under the noses of these gang lookouts, and that is where we left things. So, let's see what adventure is on the calendar for us today. As you step into the darkness of the beehive, your eyes gradually adjust to the dim glow of the honey around you. The air is filled with a loud, constant buzzing, yet no bees are in sight. Find your way around to the leader and help out some bees along the way. We're going to begin at the X and navigate around the map. Visit each numbered area along your path. Explore and resolve each area you visit before you choose your next. I don't see any hidden icons on this page, so we're down here at the X in the bottom right. I guess we'll just, is my pencil tool? Yeah, that, that's going to work. We'll follow the left hand rule here, and that takes us to this fella over here, number two, area two. Down the hall, you spot a guard sitting and relaxing on break. Roll d20 plus dexterity, reminder, stealthy. Okay. Uh, 13 plus 2 is 15. That's the best result. You glide past the guard with such stealth that he doesn't even notice your presence. You are even able to pickpocket one amber from him without noticing. Okay. So we're up to 16 amber. Okay. Uh, if we keep going, the left hand rule is just going to take us to a dead end. So I guess we'll backtrack and we'll split up here. Um, actually, let's let's go this way to area three. You find a small cage tipped on its side with a bee locked inside. Roll d20 plus dexterity reminder a locksmith or not a locksmith. Um, 19 plus 2 dexterity 21 that's easily the best result. Uh, the mechanism gives way quickly under your skilled hands and the lock springs open. The bee inside seems to understand your intent and hangs around you in hopes of helping. You have one bee helper Make a note of this and how many bee helpers you accumulate. That's fun. Okay, bee helpers. We're going to be optimistic and make it plural. <laughs> okay. Keep going here. Leave area three. Head to area six. The buzzing sound grows too loud to bear. Roll d20 plus constitution. Reminder, danger sense. We do have danger sense. That gives us plus two. But our constitution is plus zero. Four. Plus two is six. We have to get to, have to, get to 11. Um, we have our boon die. Um, I don't think anything else is going to help us, though. So... If the result is 10 or less, the loud, incessant buzzing pierces through your ears, disorienting and confusing you. You're unable to focus and your movements become erratic. Reduce your health by 1. That takes us down to 14 health. Is that going to erase for me? Yeah. 14. Okay. Oh, uh, where to now? I guess we'll just... Scooch along the outside here to area five. The beehive is made of a dried and cured wax that has hardened to support the structure. Walking along the hall, you step on a weakened portion which cracks and breaks. It gives way to a deep chamber below. Roll d20 plus dexterity, reminder, danger sense. So 13 plus 2 dexterity is 15 plus 2 danger sense is 17. That's the best result. 
Your danger sense alerts you to the impending collapse, and you deftly avoid the weakened area as the wax collapses around you. Okay. Uh, we'll head over here to area one. Um, while exploring the hive, you accidentally step into a sticky patch of honey on the ground. The sticky honey envelops you, trapping you firmly in place. Roll d20 plus strength. Reminder, danger sense. I'm, I'm, I'm very happy we have danger sense today. D oh, and it's a natural 20. We would get a boon. For rolling the 20, but we have one already. We can only have one. So that's the best result. You pull yourself free from the sticky substance with considerable effort. All right, and last but not least, we made it to the center of this labyrinth. Area four, you find a room with bees locked in cages. You may stop now or continue to explore before returning here. We've seen everything, I think. So, that, my friends, is April 24th. So, we shall say goodbye for now and visit Ivy and friends again tomorrow. I hope you'll join us. Thanks for watching.